G'day and welcome to the ACC Explains the Melbourne Cup. Right, we've given you the origin stories of the Melbourne Cup. We've told you why we care. Now it's tips on how to thrive and indeed survive the first Tuesday of November. First of all, some basics that will see you right for not just Melbourne Cup Day, but life in general. Never eat anything bigger than your head, and if you're caught with it, swallow it. Some sage advice there, Manaya. Not sure uh, it's overly relevant. The first tip we've got for you on the day is timing. You've got to time your run perfectly. Don't come out of the gates too quickly. Mm. Stay in the middle of the pack. Time your run down the home straight so you're at full pace at 5 p.m. Second tip, actually, on that note, Get your tips on early. Make sure that your bets are placed by 4pm. That way you've got a clear head and you can be focused on that home straight. Third tip, always invite the boss along. Okay, It's a great insurance policy for getting the afternoon off. If possible, rig the sweepstake so he wins or she wins and then you've got next year's event locked and loaded. Fourth tip, make sure that you check all the available options to you. The boosted odds, what bets are on. Make sure that you don't wear another woman's fascinator home. That's just going to cause more questions than it answers. That's right. Well, good luck. Godspeed. That was the Melbourne Cup Explained.